Okay, we got King of Beggars, and Doppler is gonna be pretty important for round one. Flying Redinian goes away. Uh, Ransackers are nice. I really like them. Oh, that's good. So we don't need the, uh, the Witch Hunter, as long as he doesn't have an artifact removal. Uh, let's go Doppler. Not sure what we are playing here. Uh, Tide Cloak Ransackers would be great. 84 claims G's, what? Lots of prior experience. Ooh, going with the money, right away, big bucks. Um, let's do Boris. Good thing he did that. We are actually at risk of uh, getting out tempoed, so we gotta be a little careful. Actually, I should have boosted I'm Boris because now it might get Boris. Back home. Mm. Boris got boosted. Actually, no. We play Course Blacksmith. For we boost Boris. And this goes on the Blacksmith. Seems like he doesn't care. I, I totally expected him to tempo, but he seems to be uh, more concerned with just thinning. Oh my god! Huh? I don't have the money to deal with that. And also, that was my enabler for Nathaniel. Seven point behind. And I just don't see myself coming out of this. I think we have to go for round two, and he's gonna race me. Well, I'm gonna race him. Like, he's gonna keep playing cards, and I will have no choice but to keep up. Can I get a Doppler? That would be really good. Can I get anything? Okay, Witch Hunter. Still thinning. I need to be taking this very seriously. After three plays, we gotta be in the lead. He doesn't have to take this super seriously. But I also need to play the value generators, but we're also not gonna play the summoning portal because we need that last turn, so yep. This world only two things are certain. Uh. Mm. This might not mean anything. I just have to keep up with him, so he can just he can just give me bounties and I, he might not follow up. He's he's gonna make the decision later. He has a fair bit of gold, so not bad. This has the base power of four. I can actually mark it and get, get good value when we kill it. Okay. Problem card. Yeah, he's sitting on like so much gold. Yeah, I think we're just gonna lose the game. On the back of that Philippa. If I play this, it's just gonna die. I can steal that, but that's I don't know, on the low end. This is just gonna die when I play it.
You're in trouble, guys. So, how many ways to trigger Nathaniel? One man's battlefield is another man's right match for harvest. <sighs> My hand is garbage too. Summoning portal. Actually, summoning portal is not a great choice here. Because if we played that, we would slow down so much that losing would be almost guaranteed. Losing a card. Uh, that is. We just don't have anything to win this fit. Philip of us brutal round one. Look at my hand. Oh. We can't win. Our only hope is probably to lose a card and for him to give up. We just have to mulligan the summoning portal next turn. He can just kill everything on the board. And he's super lucky with that. You lose last say. Well, I'm already super screwed. That Philippa play was... The thing is, my problem is, simply draws. That's it. If I had drown, uh, if I had Doppler here, if I had Siggy, no problem. I don't have anything. We are simply losing to draws. We're losing to nothing else but draws. Even if I had some mages, I could just blow that up. The mages would be low one. Okay. Well, I definitely have to play Coarse Blacksmith. And boost this. At least, at least a little bit. But I'm not sure if we have to play the hero power here. We have to, right? He's gonna take. He's taking two damage. We, we have to. We have to hero power, the way I see it. But if we hero power, we lose. If I if I don't hero power, I lose too. I just lose no matter what. But the only chance we have is maybe is Witch Hunter. Maybe he doesn't have other bounties. Let's see. Well, I'm gonna take bleed damage, but he's not gonna take bleed damage. That's kind of what we... That was our original plan, that we lose a card. I know it doesn't sound much much like a plan, but it is, it is the plan now. It's not gonna trigger on him. But it's the only way we don't lose the game. Our pirates will light up the north! Well, you need some cards to win, apparently. Good news is that our draws should be pretty good. Um, as long as we get some. Uh, I gotta kick the ship. And because of... Well, actually I messed up. But this could still give me a bronze, so... I suppose that's fine. Reuven. Let's see if we can somehow recover this... Uh, Disadvantage. If he plays a bean, see if he can blow it up. Casting could be a, a decent bounty target. A decent steal too. 
Renegade Mage. Uh, we might want to target the Executioner. The only problem with playing the Sea Jackal, although we can have other spenders, so we can just play the Sea Jackal. Maybe I'm not gonna play a. Uh, oh, actually, yeah. No, no, no. I don't have any other spenders left. God damn it. It's gonna be tough. Also, I need to get out the ship. You could suspect that I don't have any other spenders. I, I was forced into playing all my cards. This is gonna be tough. I got some counters. But we'll see. And some other ways to spend gold. But the Bounty guy would be pretty good. Like, for example, using Bounty on that is pretty good. And I'm not concerned about boosts. I don't think I kind of prefer it. Is he using it? Oh, he's just, he just wants the ship. Right. Uh, I kind of want the ship to just not do anything. They could even bounty target this guy, and he's my only spender. But literally, we have no other spenders. That's annoying, but... Yeah, like, who cares? I think we have some better steals. Uh, he played two bounties, keep in mind. That's a good target with morales. But then I'm gonna be struggling a little bit with money. Well that's that's still kinda break even, right? Yeah, that's kinda break even. Doesn't give me a lot of fat points. Maybe I'm gonna steal it. So we're gonna renegade mage. Uh, pay the tribute and hit the fence. Do you pay for streaming on Twitch? No. Why would I pay for it? No, that's not how it works. You 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 stream for free. But, uh, Twitch puts ads on your stream. And if you become a partner, then takes half of your money. That's how, that's how it works. So we can steal the seven. Foolishness. That's the best bounty target. Currently the five. He's doing very well. And I have to say the fences are ridiculous, so yeah, that makes a lot of sense. These cards are so ridiculous that maybe we gotta go back to King of Beggars. Thank you for the answer, I appreciate it even more than you gave me my laziness to not check online. Yeah, sure. It was a fair question. It just kind of, you made me wonder, like, is there a, like a paid version of like, I don't know, do, can, I pay, can I pay for streaming? Can I pay for some extra service? So, maybe wonder about that, but no, no, just the uh, regular streaming is like totally free. You just need to get a key from Twitch, and you need to get a software that you can stream with. I'm using OBS. Uh, that seems to be a very popular choice, and you do that, and you're, you're, you're gold. So... We... 
mark that for gold. My time the north was cleansed. And be dunk on it. The more else gets played. Actually, no. It's not how I should have done it. I, we should have played the Sea Jekyll first. We lost one point. He has a lot of spenders. Syndicate is still too strong? I don't think so. He got murdered by the nerfs. You just need to play it completely differently. All the cards that got nerfed, they got removed from the game, except Dijkstra. Uh, I asked because my friend told me there's a fee for it. No, 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 you just, uh, just stream for free. And people will come, hopefully. Oh, look at that! We won anyway. That's because I had some crazy cards coming up for last round. But I didn't get first two rounds. But yeah, this was an intense game. GG. Okay, we got a King of Beggars here. Lexi. Uh, I don't want the ship. We got two Dopplers, that's great. So, round one should be totally fine. We're not gonna get super punished like last time. This could be okay. Yeah. Still looking to improve the, the hand. Not for this round, but for last round. I think I'm gonna go and play the Scorch three times. Please drop. Doesn't care, he just wants gold. And I don't care too much about the Dopplers for last round. Then we gotta play a Tax Collector that's boosted, maybe. Then we pass. Shut. Map's upside down again. Corporations are people too. I call this move the tempo pass. You play three cards, then you pass. Okay, this guy's not too tempo, but this is the only throwaway card I got. But the idea behind this that your opponent has to answer with five cards. Not four. Exotic wonders for affordable prices. And a long round three is guaranteed. Even if even if we go, have to go first, which is totally fine if you're playing a value generator deck. Between brothers, harmony rarely reigns. I can have some throwaways next turn too. What is my dog? Oh my god, this guy is all about for later value. Look at this. He had some Dectining, he had uh, Boshodi to make Evolt better, and Tamara to make the, the Witch Hunters better. Deals, deals. Novigrad's built. <laughs> and he's like, trying to get his gold up. Why would you boost? Oh, yeah, he actually has to get more points. I didn't even realize. You need to use boost again. Oh, damn. He was playing it super greedy. I managed to generate some value with the uh, Tax Collector. Well, that's good. We need a long ground for that, so now that the long ground is guaranteed, I'm pretty happy with that. Witch Hunter, we don't need in hand. Uh, that's one spender. We need spenders. But I suppose there are still some good cards in the deck. The thing is, there's so many good cards in there. I'm like, I don't want I want them all. So maybe tax collector should be kicked. Ooh, flying Rodinian. Uh, I think we yeah, we gotta play the flying Rodinian here. And that's it. We're just keeping the mulligans. Yeah, this is good. Okay, that's another spender. Spender that I prefer. Like, one Sea Jackal is okay, but we don't need two. Uh, no. No. 
Again, we don't need so many spenders. Okay, we never found a good card. We followed up with a summoning circle, most likely. Maybe... Front Spender. Doom Siggy. So I want to play a Bunty guy. And maybe a Tycloak Ransacker. Or possibly a Sea Jackal. If my Sea Jackal gets shut down. Uh, we can't really play the coarse blacksmith now. Uh, we can't go Sea Jackal and boost it by a little bit. And we can do Siggy next turn. Then we play Nathaniel. Then we go coarse blacksmith. Fine. There's nothing to shut down right now. Lexi, the wild boar! Come on! It, it, it's, it's strong play. Come, don't get me wrong, this is very strong. Fans, 10 points for 6. Ridiculous. That's fine. I'm totally fine with that. Uh, there's nothing I really want to mark here. We can mark that as a 10 pointer destroy, which is ridiculous. Graden can go for it. Get three points. Yeah, that, that's the problem. Like, okay, you don't get a lot of points for that, but you get a lot of points for the destruction. Do I bounty mark that? Maybe not. But I gotta do the bounty mark next turn. So I trigger this by one. We play Nathaniel. Actually, you can do the Nathaniel combo in one turn with the summoning portal, which is ridiculous. I could have done that next turn. If he if he wanted to actually get out another guy. Which is, that's kind of ridiculous. Then you then you kind of ignore the disadvantage of it. How much do I want to boost him? We can just boost this guy, the Sea Jackal. Then also boost Nathaniel quite a bit. I can just... Yeah, I just... I just... Not screw around with the Bounty. Let's say this is gonna die. That gives me a lot of Bounty. Ho ho ho! The fans got a lot of bleeds! Okay. Nate got harder move. What are you doing? I'm not sure what we're targeting. Target morales. Is there anything to steal here? No. This is this is a bit awkward, but I, I I think we have to do something like morales. On, not sure what. I could have healers. Not in terms of my guts, more than a filthy stage. 
<laughs> just that. We're just using the damage. Come on, if the bleeds were a little bit more even. So good. Lexi, come on. Ooh. A five pointer. Not sure what I would want from the summoning circle. Well, we gotta use Graydon on that one. But actually, no, we can't. We use Graydon on Ithir and Elidia. We use Witch Hunter. By time the North was cleansed. And Orson Jr. or Caleb Manga. A lot of gold. Let's just not use it, because we still have Philippa. Actually, we should use some of that gold. Currently, we have two value generators, and I can actually get out another sea guy. Okay, sea is only three points. Lead everything. And get this guy out another six. If we have enough money. This might get targeted by a bounty. I, I'm a, do I really want to steal up to a 9? Do I need that? <sighs> if you target that, we get 5 gold. So I need to use at least 2 here. Then we do nothing. Oh, I need to use a card. We had nine gold, and we're not using the rest. If we have to, we play out the Sea Jackal. If not, we play a Tyclo Brandsacker. Fancy is just quietly bleeding to death in the back. You're fine. You're just you're doing fine in the back. Just just keep doing what you're doing, okay? Yeah, kind of suspected that. And now we can steal that big Graydon and also. Yeah, if we play the money guy, it's not the best. Well, it, it, they are both gonna be fives. So we need Philippa. We're still great then. We got the guy. Unfortunately, nothing is at two. So this is gonna be a five. This is a five two. Uh, we can't kill that. Tactical Grand Sackers. Go for some boosts. Maybe one of the guys that have higher base power and at the risk of getting bountied for good value. It doesn't really matter. The Blacksmith is already one of those guys. Oh, nice. Well played. Close oh, game! We lost by four points. Yeah, well played. Calabanga was decent. Yeah, GG.